I am of the opinion that MMTLP is not deleted and is in a chilled status. If you go to the FINRA website and search for only U3 halts, then around 345 stock tickers appear over 7 pages of U3 halted tickers on the FINRA website. I went through each ticker and found only 10 U3 halted tickers were subsequently deleted with the issuance of a D1 code. MMTLP however has not been given a D1 code, and therefore is not deleted, contrary to FINRA's court submission. Of the 10 U3 halted stocks that were subsequently deleted, only 4 stocks were issued a D1 deletion code in less than 20 days immediately after being put on a U3 halt status. These 4 are. DGZAF was deleted after 10 days of being under a U3 halt. DXTRQ was deleted on the 3rd day of being under a U3 halt. EXGI was deleted on the 4th day of being under a U3 halt. ICPWQ was deleted on the 20th day of being under U3 halt. The remaining 6 stocks were deleted after their U3 halt status converted into a U1 halt or H10 halt status. U3 halted IBTGF was issued a D1 code after 4 days of being under a U1 halt. U3 halted ISQMF was issued a D1 code after 3 months of being under a U1 halt. U3 halted PCFG was issued a D1 code after 7 days of being under a H10 halt. U3 halted PNTV was issued a D1 code after 10 days of being under a H10 halt. U3 halted VMI I was issued a D1 code after 1 day of being under a U1 halt. U3 halted VODG was issued a D1 code after 10 days of being under a H10 halt.